So what is God teaching you in this season of your life? What kind of lessons are you learning? What kind of things is he showing you in this, you know, second year of the pandemic? I mean, the pandemic isn't really over because people are still wearing masks and people are getting vaccinated and, you know, some people aren't getting vaccinated and everybody has to make that choice for themselves. But what are you learning? What is God teaching you? I've been intentionally um, asking God to show me what are you teaching me during this season? And a song has been coming up over and over for me that I'm going to sing for you in a minute. And I feel like God has been showing me about crowded spaces. And this is a really difficult um, lesson for me to learn because I'm, you know, somewhat of a minimalist. I'm not a hoarder. I'm not a person that likes to keep everything. I like kind of a an empty-ish you know, feeling in my home. I don't like to feel crowded, but the Lord's been showing me my heart has been crowded and my heart has had a lot of stuff inside of it. And I think, you know, after listening to this song so many times, I think he's, he's showing me, you know, um, what he's trying to teach me through this song. He's showing me a little bit of it tonight. And so I wanted to share it with you and, um, pardon if it's off tune. Um, so I'm going to just play this and then I'm going to read a scripture, okay? Here is where I lay it down Every burden, every crown This is my surrender I will make 
So I want to share this scripture with you from Romans 15, chap, um, verse 1. And what it talks about in Romans 15 is it talks about how we are, we who are strong ought to bear the weaknesses of those who are without strength and not just please ourselves. And so that is the gospel. The gospel is about not pleasing yourself. Are you living a life of pleasing yourself? Is it all about you? Is it all about your problems and your needs? <laughs> you know, your issues. Um, God is teaching me this. He's working in me this truth about, you know, being willing to bear the weaknesses of others and, and not to please myself not to want things in my life to go the way I want them, but to go the way that Christ wants them to go in my life. And that's really what it's all about. It's about pleasing God and living our life as a pleasing aroma and sacrifice unto Christ. So that's really basically what I wanted to share is make room for Christ in your heart by laying down your burdens and when you make room for Christ in your heart, then you'll have room for others in your heart. You'll have room to be able to bear the burdens of others in your life. So thank you so much for listening. I hope that this ministered to you, and I pray you have a great night. Thank you.